Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Sky World. As always, I'm your Owen. Last time we were here, we had turned in. Uh, we are. I think believe we are short two crystals. We had gone over to the little water to spawn the squid. We went into that dungeon, which I found out was just an end portal. We also found out that down here we have a bunch of ender chests and enchantment table and some anvils. So if I really want to repair things, I can repair them. And that just led, yeah, that just led to the outside. To the outside world. Now, I remember we have blaze powder, but I don't think we have an eye of ender and here I go again clicking to try and get the no we've only got the blaze powder right now so if we've, we've got to find an eye of ender we just throw some of this stuff away that I don't need I still still have my starter axe which is just amazing I'm gonna throw my good. No, no, I'm gonna throw those all. These are gonna go in the special. Glowstone dust, randoms. Uh, I could use that. I don't need the stone hoe. I don't. Don't think I'll need the shovel. I will need the pick though. Torches, oak slabs. Not right now. Okay. Sleep. So today, what we're gonna do? is we are going to go and explore those clouds which means as it's meant in almost every episode now <laughs> uh, I'm going to collect me some some cobblestone because that's gonna be a long staircase up and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it from Let's see if I can figure it out what a way to start a video what a way to start the video Ugh. I'm just glad that so I don't think that he you're not no you're selling me bread for emeralds and we don't have any emeralds and I don't know of any way to get an emerald and of course big tray never fails I mean I like big trees because they do end up they do give you more wood but oh, they're such a pain to destroy so I'm thinking it might be best If I do a like a staircase from oh, no, just gonna, no, that's not gonna work because that's too far away from me. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like a staircase from this corner, which is gonna be a pain in the ass, but. Hey, that happens. But anyway, uh, as per normal, I'm going to uh, cut the video. And I'm going to gather me uh, probably a butt ton, uh, a literal butt ton of <laughs> cobblestone. So hopefully we can, uh... But no, I was going to go check those out too. So I'm going to go grab those slabs that I had in the bucket. Now if I'm not mistaken, unless this has changed, I don't think it has yet. Um, you can't burn slabs. Although I think I'm going to do it with stone anyway, so it's not like it's going to matter. So I get my 
cobblestone slabs and uh, someone did something on Skype sorry Skype person I am recording it's probably a willow void which I probably should get a hold of him to see uh, about recording trying to re record a, a minecraft a mini game minecraft Monday but I also kind of want to do these uh, weekend ones first try to get my recordings all done in order so I wanted to see and I don't think there is but I wanted to see if there was possibly a chest hidden in this lava because there's obviously not one hidden in the water so I gotta be very careful here okay that should be close enough to where I can go yoink come on yoink let me yoink it is there just not a source block there? Or am I not close enough? Yoink! Okay, I just wasn't close enough. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here. Actually, why don't I just do it here? It's going to burn the planks, but oh well. Well, we'll just... How many, how many are there? Three? Yeah, it looks like there's three. So we go... One, two, go, whoa, don't fall off. Three, and then what I'm going to do is place it right there. Okay. First lava fall figured out, and by the looks of it, I mean, we, it's going to take it forever for it to fully fade, but it doesn't look like there's one there. <clears throat> I hate how slow lava can be. Now, I could be totally doing this for nothing, and there could... It could possibly be that there is no chest inside any of these lava, lava falls. Which is a total and complete possibility, albeit a really crappy one. You're going right there. Okay. At the very least, I'm going to have a very big lava <coughs> lava wall and the really bad inability to speak. Am I close enough to you that I can pluck you? No. So I'll just do this. This. you up. Darn. It's kind of hoping that maybe there'd been something there. But, I mean, be a great place to hide a... Oh yeah, these, these woods are going to go. <clears throat> Which is fine. I have... I want to make sure that I have no use for... Oh! Okay, I don't have anything in here I need. No way. Whoa, that was close. Make this a little thicker, just so I can get around the lava. See, if that's going to burn, that whole thing will probably burn down, unfortunately. But that's, you know, the price I pay for my decision didn't look like there was anything past that, so... <clears throat> I am going to need to... Actually, I have a better idea. And it's going to require... It's still going to have to require cobblestone, so I am still going to have to get a lot of cobblestone. And I'm going to have to make a lot of ladders. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a... landing platform. I'm going to pick a spot and make a nice little platform for it and then I'm going to basically turn it into a giant diving board so I got to find the holy look at that tray I got to find the exact spot I'm kind of looking around make sure I'm not I haven't missed any island or anything I want to find the exact spot that's going to be the best 
There's not like one really far down that I'm missing, and I don't think so, no. I think the farthest one down was that wool one. I hear you, villager. You wouldn't have put, like, a chest on the bottom of this, would you? Come on. Just a little more. Okay. No. You didn't. definitely didn't put a chest on the bottom. That would have been a really mean thing for you to do. And I probably would have done the same thing. <laughs> If I was a map maker, which I'm not. I'm a map player. Okay, so it was our pumpkin that ha uh, took the unfortunate end. So, let's see if I can figure out where it's going to be. See, judging by straight up and down, that's actually not going to work. And I, I, I kind of want to make sure that I'm not going to fall off here. So if I'm judging it, if I'm looking straight, okay, this is straight, and I'm like, I'm on this block right here. So going straight up, I need to move, what, one, two, three blocks. That looks good. So I'm going to say about right here. I know that was more than three, but Let's make a platform. So I'm going to go up this spot right here. It's going to be a nice little pillar is generally what that's going to be. And then I need to go one out this way. I'm gonna make a line here, and I do need to take. A, I do need to rest, and I'm out of. So that's where the pillar is going. Is right there. I need to sleep. Make more slabs. <clears throat> and off screen. More cobblestoning. Yay. <clears throat> Which is all right. Whatever's. Oops, I need to make these into slabs, didn't I? Oops, uh, just to try and cut down on how many I need to make, I am going to not make a full thing of cobblestone, because I don't need that many slabs. Okay. So then this part should go... Two, one more. Oh, and I'm making them out of. Well, there was a waste of freaking cobblestone. Oh well. And then it goes. Like that. And then. This should connect right up. Alright. Aha! I am all the smarts. And we close this off. then if we take these slabs no I didn't really need that one right there pretty sure you can hear my cat right there <sighs> what oh I almost made it yeah it looks like we've got everything connected except for those clouds so the parkour map that is planned on following this one looks like it's going to be a lot of failure, just simply based on how well I've been doing recently. Heck, I can go a 
Put that there. I can't. Oh, sucks. I can't. That would be pointless to put that there. So why don't we put that there, there. And then we'll go there, there. Ah, okay. So I don't need these two then. Well, I need them. I just don't need them there. Okay. So the next thing we got to do is go block these up. Really? One short. It's just wood. I guess I can use this. So there. So then, if I get my bucket. I don't need you here anymore. This should make a at least a partially safe landing area, if not a safe landing area. Now, I still have no idea why I decided to make my infinite water source all the way up here, but hey, it, it is what it is. It's definitely making for an interesting base layout. Whoa! Getting a little little careless there, you're on. I will be turning this into an infinite water source if I can. I, I do believe I can. I should be able to. I don't see why I shouldn't why I can. And I'm rambling. So in this episode, we're not really doing much as much as we're preparing. We're getting it we're getting things ready for the future. Hopefully. Um, I was informed recently that there is a another challenge did that making it making an infinite source. Yes, it did. Uh, there is another challenge. Um, obviously, we have to. We have the. Uh, do I have any ladders? No. I need more ladder. Which I will take all 14 oak wood. But anyway, as I was saying, the uh, the other challenge that I've been informed about uh, is taking on the Ender Dragon, which we all know is not my forte. If you've if you've watched any of my hexit and of Derp Derper McDerperston right there, if you've watched any of my uh, hexit. At least to the point of where I'm, I obviously am not meant to fight the Ender Dragon. I have just enough, don't I? Ah. Um, to where I've attempted to take on the Ender Dragon, you'll know it's not my best fight. Now, I don't know if the end is any different. In fact, I don't even know if... Because I know I know in Hexit, um, Hexit added those extra towers and such with the sponge and the Enderman faces and all that, you know, good jazz. Now in this one, I'm not sure How well I'll do. I might do a little better because it's I do. It's just going to be a normal vanilla uh, Ender Dragon fight, albeit if unless he's changed the uh, the end map on this one as well. I mean, if he has, then cool. No, but that's something to look forward to. Um, I do have the resources that I need. To go into the nether, although I don't see a reason to go to the nether. So, 
Um, so next time I got like maybe 10 minutes, I might even pause the video just to get up there. You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to pause the video here and then I'm going to make my way up to the clouds. I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright, so I have myself a stack of cobblestone and some ladders. Hopefully I won't need this full stack, but up we go. So hopefully there won't be like some big giant disappointment when I get up here. More so, hopefully I'll be able to land in that um, diving hole that I have. Up close. Oh, oh, cool. I actually think I lined this up almost perfectly. Oh, this is... Okay, so we're up here in the clouds. We've got the light shard, which we knew was up, gonna be up here. Some carrots and potatoes that we can grow. Is there not anything hidden in here, is there? Yeah, I think past that it's just down. Sorry, but no. Just because I don't need mobs dropping on my head. I'm gonna light these up. Shit. Ow. <sighs> well, I don't know if my water th spot worked because I didn't land in the water. I do know, though, that I didn't need that many cobblestone. And I'm going to check the rest because I'm totally... We're still missing an Eye of Ender. Or not... Well, yeah, we're missing an Eye. We're missing a, uh... An Ender Pearl, really. Because then you can add the Blaze Powder to the Ender Pearl and get yada yada. Which, I hope I'm not supposed to actually spawn them. Which, you know, that could be what the, um, soul sand's for. Maybe the soul sand spawns Enderman that I didn't know about. Well, fine. Be that way. Still got a couple more we gotta go explore. I'm gonna put a torch on each one of these. Might as well. <clears throat> this way I'll know that I'm not bending. No. OCD is OCD. Okay, I'm definitely not making that jump. And I do have wood planks in case I run out of cobblestone here. And I would like to take this cobblestone away and keep the clouds as they are because I thought they looked pretty cool. These, that's just a spot there. Whew, thought I missed that one. Anything? Anything? No. Doesn't look like it. Major bummer. And that's just, yeah. So now I get to, this is going to be kind of a waste of cobblestone, I know. But oh well. I don't think it'll look cool with these cobblestone things connecting to it. Okay, I'm like, I do have another pick, right? Now, I am starting to seriously think I missed the water shard. And I don't know how. I feel like the water shard is somewhere where water was, which would have been that thing. 
at the very least, or maybe even in one of those, but it's in neither. I don't know. I'm going to lose a lot of these ladders because they're going to go off into nowhere. But that's fine. Hopefully I won't lose this pick mid midway down. So yes, now I know that this diving pit of water was kind of useless at this point. However, it looks cool. Or at least I think it looks cool. No. Oh, look at that. Some of our ladders survived. <clears throat> so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to waste even more of this cobblestone because, you know what, why not? And for the last bit of this episode, although I should be using this time to I'm gonna fall like no one's business I should be using this time to uh... you know what, no, we're gonna do that real quick uh, I'm gonna go over and I'm gonna meet you by the temple we're gonna figure out what this is all right. So once again, I was informed that same with the dark shard as the light shard, I have to take this out and grab the other villager egg. Where did that? There it is. Grab the sandstone back so it looks cool. Throw the light shard in the hopper. So yeah, I'm just missing the water shard. Which I don't know, I think I'm missing something. Maybe hmm. I mean, he wouldn't map maker wouldn't uh, throw me to the nether for water because you can't put water in the nether so you wouldn't find the water shard there would you I mean I have the ability to make the to make um, another portal I just gotta get more of the obsidian get some wood and set it on fire I don't necessarily need a flint and steel you know set it on fire using lava so, I mean, there are ways around having to need a flint and steel for a nether portal. I need... did I save any fence? No, I don't even have enough stick to make more fence. You know what? I think I'm gonna make this guy. Because he was in the sky, he gets something fancier. He gets his done in cobblestone wall. So I'm going to put you there. And we're going to go wall. Oh, the walls don't connect. Well, fine. I don't think I'm going to have enough. drop down here. Huh. Totally didn't need it to go out that far. I was just trying to be fancy apparently. Huh. It's gonna give this guy extra room. Not. Huh. Just because he's a villager doesn't mean he's it's that much special treatment. So then I just throw the villager in there. Huh. And whoa. Huh. Oh well, okay, fine anyway. What do you want? Books for an emerald. Really? <laughs> oh man, really? 
and then emerald for bread. But I don't really need that. You know what this means? Well, for starters, this means I get to extend this out. A little bit more. Yay, melons. Because I get to make potato and carrot farm. I was also told that uh, I lost a cactus. A normal cactus. In the uh, explosion where I got my big cactus, my extra sharp cactus, which doesn't belong in this chest. I throw my seeds in there as well. I keep trying to sort with my button. So yeah, you know what that means? We get to breed the cow. <laughs> oh, do I have any sugar cane? Like, did I get sugarcane at all? No. I don't have sugarcane to make paper, to make books. I don't have an eye of Ender. Well, I really have one, one more option to do, and that's go to the nether. Yeah. So, I might have to make another platform. Probably out this direction. Which is going to be a pain in the butt to do. But, that's, I mean, how much obsidian did I end up collecting? Two? I need eight more. So I'm going to do, I'm going to collect the obsidian off screen. Um... so much work. Wait a minute, wasn't there? Before I get too into uh, thinking about having to go into the, the nether, I think there was sugar cane on this island. I will go check that island once again. I mean, if there is, then that's awesome. If not, then I will work on getting another portal up and going, which we will be doing next time. Can't wait to see you guys then. Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, I'm your Owen. Happy gaming, guys. Hello, guys. Uh, you're Owen here, once again. Uh, just wanting to uh, tell you a little bit about this screen that you're seeing now. Anyway, uh, if you click on the little subscribe button there in the center, uh, it'll subscribe you to my channel if you haven't already. Also, uh, there'll be buttons for Hexit and The Sims 3. If you haven't checked those videos out, those buttons will send you to the playlist. Feel free to click them, check them out. Let me know how you feel. And as always, in the description of every single one of my videos is my URLs for my Facebook, my Twitter, and my Twitch account, where I post things, I talk to you guys, and sometimes occasionally we'll stream. So, as always, thank you guys so, so very much for watching. Happy gaming, guys.